Happy New Year, folks. Happy Hockey Wednesday. Last game of the night, but definitely not the least important game of the night. This one hopefully will end out with a bang and a great start to the new year for these two teams. Tonight, we've got a special treat for you. Uh, Gwendolyn Black Knights versus the Islanders. And best ball by the Islanders and the Gwendolyn Black Knights. Names on the back of their jerseys. So, if I can't remember a name off the top of my head, now I got reference. My name is Claude Fruit Fruit Pocket Swollens, play DCHO Action uh, for the Midnight Riders. We will be on a bye week this Sunday, but hopefully you'll still hear my voice for streaming. Referees for this game include Jason McIstein and Carlos Cruz. And you are, and you are just in time to watch some awesome rec level hockey. And just because this get, these, these are rec, don't count these guys as soft. These guys will be hard. Gwendolyn Black Knights, a great franchise. Play, them that, play with them in the inaugural year. Islanders a pretty new team on the scene wearing the neon green jerseys. Ball drops, game has started. It's a cold night outside, but it's a beautiful night inside for hockey as we get our first stop of play. We've got Seek joining us, having the name on the back of my jersey is the coolest thing ever, Seek says. And I can agree more. Even though I'm not famous, I feel like I am. Face off one by Gwendolyn, great job. I believe that was Aaron over there. As this ball is getting, go into the zone, and taken over by the Islanders right now. It's out of the zone. They're gonna, everyone's going to come back. Islanders taking over right now. Pass it to Claus. Stopped up by the uh, the um, poster right there. So the ball does not leave the zone. And finally it does. Taking a big and pass it to Claus. To Nick. Nick can't get there. And it's uh, broken up. And Nick can't get there either. Other Nick, I just say. And this ball is going to be taken care of in the corner right now. Now it's the, it's the Nick again. Matt keeps it in for his team. And that, one, that side does not go through. Looked like whipped on that one. Orion trying to get through, cannot do so either. Orion now has himself. He's going to get the zone, and he's going to try to get through there. And he cannot look like Anna was the one who broke it up. Taking over right now for the Islanders. I guess he thought his team was also to get the ball back to them. I don't think that's the best strategy, but wherever it works, I guess. Islanders have right now in the zone. Fire is saved by PJ. And the ball is loose. Finally comes out. Comes out. Doesn't include the zone, but at least includes the slot in the corner right now. That shot is a little misdirected and it does come out of the zone. Can't really see too well of where it is. Finally out of there. Matt's going to play this one in the corner for his team. Looking, tries to get it out of there, hits the backboard. We're getting an interference foul, not an interference uh, penalty. So Faisal's going to stay in the zone. Still five on five. They saw have won by the Islanders. Well, actually, no, it looked like it's by Black Knight's great shot, but Goldie was in a better position, makes a save, and it makes it look easy, too. This ball is going to clear the zone. And look like I can't see who takes it, takes it over right there, and Bond is going to clear the zone. For well, Matt has it right now. Matt, breakaway, fires, goal! Matt Duganzik. He didn't need any fancy moves on that one, says hammered it behind the goaltender, and our score right now is one to nothing. Yeah, it's an unassisted, unassisted goal right there by Matt. She was able to take that one over. It looked like it was a bad pass. Welling up now 1-0 as they win the faceoff. And Andrew's got to try to get it through. Andrew can not get to Greg. So it's Mario's ball to play right now for the Islanders. They're trying to make a comeback. He's in the corner right now. Looking, he's got Zess. He's got her behind the cage. And he really passed a great pass. Try to pass back. Now it's a Tim who's got it. Trying to take it out of the zone. And he, get, he gets it out of the zone, but cannot get the zone for his team. Valen in neutral zone right now, and Valen to pass it back uh, to Justin Zinn, they didn't get anything better. Nick tried to do something with it, cannot do, so, do something with it. Zeke says he was just ice skating earlier. And I gotta ask, if you were playing ice hockey, you were just ice skating. 
Right now, no one's brought any, anybody on skates yet with some fancy deeks, but we have some great shooting. That's why the score right now is one to nothing. Son, oh no! PJ thought he had it, but did not, and that was sneaks by him for a goal for the Islanders. And the score in the game is tied. I didn't see exactly who got that goal. By the way, Islanders right now are up 1 0. I mean, I'm sorry, up 1 to 1. Tied with 60 minutes left in the period. Clean win by the Islanders, but they didn't exactly poke it back. With that in mind, Chris has it right now in the zone. Sick and Bacon trying to move through. Chris trying to do something with it, cannot do so. And David intercepts that one. He shoots it wide of the net, but at least it gets deep into the zone. Looking to make a play. Cannot cut the pass he wants to. And oh no, that definitely is a penalty. He was a victim of thinking up there was his ice hockey. Two minutes for whirling around with this stick. David Bromelo, I'm assuming your Mandy's sister, nice to meet you, is watching in Michigan. Share this with your friends. Let's get this, let's get this nationally known, if we can. That would be pretty cool. I, I like to be in, I like to be uh, American famous. Husband games in Texas, maybe New York. I don't know. Zeke, on the other hand, is telling Peter to take it off. It was a tough tough break for him, and I I couldn't agree more. We're gonna see. Oh, what's the what's the What's going on here? Okay, so interesting call. So, so assuming from the, I'm assuming this from the referees, they will give. Uh, I can't, forgot the name of the man who made that penalty. I want to say Chris Pons' name. I don't remember exactly though. But because it's new to the league and did not know you can do that, he will only get a warning. So even though the face is taking over, power play time will not start. Chris has it right now. Chris, so Murphy jumps it through. Kelly gets there first. Kelly looking to make a play, and it goes off his stick wall. And it's trying to take over right now beyond her case. Boxes him out. And taking over right now. Passes across, intercepted. And he fires. Looks like his own teammate, though. Miscommunications going on right now. Got again, looking, looking. Passes, can't get, needs to get, needs to get out of the zone. And finally they do. David's going to have it right now. Sig talking about this being a fast-paced game. I couldn't agree more, and that's the way I love hockey. Fast-paced bowling burners are my favorite kinds of game. Yeah. That's the Chris. Chris trying to take over right now. Chris passes across, and Chris takes it over right now. Can't tell. This doesn't have a name, or a or or I guess his name for the face of the case either. Passes across. Can't get to Chris, and it has it right now. And it gets the zone clear. That's the David. David passes it back. And that one's hit up, down now, looking to get it through, moving through, tries to get something going on, can't get it there because the defense is there first. And Chris gets there. Taking over in the corner right now for the Islanders. They want to try to convert the into offense as that as it just blocked that shot. Matt cannot get a stick back on there. And that's turnover was gonna it might be costly. Kelly tries to fire, gets clear uh, soft sock always went wide anyway. Golden he stopped it. This one's gonna get be kept in by Gwellen Black Knights. Take care of the quiz. Now it's Aaron. Aaron trying to do something with it. So I don't think that's Aaron. That's Aaron's name, but I don't think it's Aaron. Look like it's Orion, I think I wanna say. And that was gonna be held on right there. For a stop of the play. The person wearing the Pru the Pruion jersey, I thought it was uh, I don't know why I thought it was Aaron. That's not even his last name, but it looked like it's Orion. He's gonna be taking the face off right now, and face off is one, and now as to Andrew who who dumps it in, uh, dumps it in, and it now is to Kelly. We've got Ben Wilson watching in the house with us. Welcome to the stream, Ben. Score right now is one to one as it's battle in the corner right now. Tries to pull around. And Zeke is selling to Chris. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna go with Chris. Right now it's Nick who has it though. As he's battling three guys off right now. 
And Mandy tries to keep it in, cannot do so either. Finally, it's Andrew who does. Almost a high stick on uh, Mario. And finally, Islanders take possession, but they, can they get it out? They cannot. Andrew doing a good job keeping this in. Almost another high stick. These guys have to watch the sticks right now. One warning has already been used. You, you cannot use another one. And fires wide the net. And it's the Nick again. Nick looking. Nick passes to Andrew. Andrew trying to get it deep. Fires wide of the net. It would have been high anyway if it hit there. Fires again. It's going to go wide. Wellens having all kinds of pressure right now. We are moving through. Looking around. Fires towards the middle, towards the slide. Can't get it there. Can Nick keep it in? Battle right now at the boards. Mario, took, Mario won in hard, but doesn't fall. And this one finally is clear of the net of the zone. No ice is called. But Islanders can't convert the offense. Look like it's Gwendolyn is going to have it first in the corner. Can't tell what's going on. From the way. Oh, it looks like Islanders have it. But they will not be able to do too much with it if Nick can get this out. They, Nick cannot get it out. It's cupped in. Mandy tries to keep uh, that in for her team. And battle the boards right now. Kept in for the Islanders. Trying to move through. Trying to get the pass across. And can he get there? Oh, Tom taking a big and fires wire the net. Passes the cross, can't get there either. And kept in. Looking. Fires with the heavy clapper. Looked like it hit Nick first. Fires again, and it looked like they, uh, they had to fuck that one wide. And that one should be an icing. Face off one, looked like Gwendolyn won it, but Islanders are gonna get back to the ball first. Try to take it in the zone. This one's gonna come around the cage. Now taking over again. Fires towards the slot, can't get it there. And now it's Kelly who's gonna try to get it out of there. Kelly does, and that one will not be an icing. He's in the neutral zone. So he dumps it in deep for his team. Frankie G is taking over for his team. Tried to make a center and pass, but defense was there instead first. And Islanders trying to, uh, to go from defense to offense. Andre keeps it in. Uh, and Kelly suits it, but it goes wide, wide the net, hits the defender instead. And great job by Matt. Matt fires and hits somebody on the way to the net. And Islanders making a three on two right now, but great defense right there. And defense still there. Fires! Oh, it looked like it won the net, but unfortunately it went behind the net. Just possession went bad for me. And the shot went bad for him. There will not be a penalty on that tumble. It looked like he just slipped. Fires wide the net. On the corner right now. Let me make some sort of play with it. Gwendolyn trying to get it out. It does not go out. Matt's going to keep it in. Matt don't, throws in deep. Fires. Looks like they, he didn't get all of it like he wanted to. And finally, Matt gets it out of the zone. But it looked like the other Matt is going to take over for his team. Passes it across. Gets it, gets it to one of his teammates. Dan takes it over. Tries to dump it in deep. And it's in the corner right now for the Islanders. Looking to make a play. Fires wide the net. And Dan's going to try to take over right now. Dan fires, and it looked like it, that one went out of the slot. And Jess will not be able to corral it, so this one's going to come out of the zone. And Mario's going to have it right now. Mario looking to make a play, taking and banging behind his own cage. And that's, that one went red. Can they get there? Oh, great stick lift. And that shot does not go like uh, Chris wanted to. Fires, easy save for PJ. It was low, and barely trickled through the defense. Mandy trying to get it out there. Fires again. Saved by PJ. And fires by Dan. That one goes wide. Gwendolyn needs to get it out. They're facing all the time. The pressure right now. It's now to Quince in the corner. Islanders have it instead. Looking to make some sort of play with it. Can't really suit too well because of the uh, camera's perspective. Finally comes out of the corner. We can see a little bit. And can Matt get it out of there? Matt will get it out. And we've got three on two developing. Great way to get it out. Matt has it right now. Matt trying to go around. Maybe wrap around past this center. Oh my goodness! I don't know who that hit, but it went in the back of the net. And Matt's got his second of the game. Gwendolyn's got its second of the game. Two to one, he's just score right now. And we've got less than five minutes left in this period.
Face off one by Gwendolyn. And they want to keep this momentum going up right now as Andrew throws it, throws it in deep. Mario beat Chris to, Chris to the ball, but Chris gave so much of a hard court take, he couldn't do it uh, the best way he wanted to. Still comes out of the zone as Allen is trying to take over, trying to convert from defense to offense. They throw this one in deep. Fires towards the middle, Manny breaks it up. Manny looking to make a play. Tries to throw it out of there, comes in surprisingly. Good stick by him, but Matt still couldn't go out it. And now he's going to retry. Matt throws it in through. It's to Tom. Tom, wow, what a great move by him. We've got three on one right here. Oh, and broke a great breakup by Mandy. She was not threatened by it at all. Will this be a nice thing? And it will not be a great hustle by Chris. Kills it off. And that was finally called. And that one took a very long time on that one to call. So I thought that Chris killed it. I guess not. We've got Matt to the house. Welcome to this team, too. Earlier, Matt scored a goal. And Gwendolyn's right now is up 2-1. We've got about 3.35 left in this period. Still enough time for Islanders to make a comeback or for Gwendolyn to stop blowing this one wide open. Earlier, Gwendolyn, uh, the other Gwendolyn team, the Gwendolyn Guardians and D2, completely demolished their competition 4-8 in the first game of the season and first game of the, first game of the New Year's. As to uh, the boy right now, he fires. It's going to be saved by the goaltender. Now he have the angle he wanted to. This one will be a no ice. Looked like it hit Manny in the hand before it went out of there. Andrew trying to take, get it out of there. He cannot do so. Tom has it. Tom fires wide of the net. And Seek is going to call uh, call it early that he, that he thinks Matt can hit a hat trick. Oh, great save by uh, Andrew. I, I, don't, I don't know. Uh, I, w I don't want to be a pessimist, Seek. But usually when someone calls something, it goes the opposite way. So I want to, I want to put all my eggs in one basket right here. And Thiel is, is rooting for the uh, rooting for the Nets right now. With 2:30, 2:30 left, we'll see exactly what can, they can do with this one. Great face-off win by the Islanders, and they will keep try to keep possession right here. That's been a slash. I'm surprised the one called. And Dan fires towards the net. That one was, goes wide. And taking over right now with 2.10 left. Oh, wait, there was a whistle blown. Stop the play. Not sure what the call was for, but we will have a, uh, a restart right here. Face off one. Look like the Islanders got to it first. Black not trying to take over right now. Pass the Frank G. Pass it to Matt. They get into the zone, but don't get position. Finally, Frank suits it, and it's going to go wide of the net. And oh, that one was deflected almost towards Matt. Could have hit the hat trick right there. Matt's gonna try to hit the hat trick right here. Oh, great job by the goaltender with the sprawl out poke check. That one's gonna come deep into the zone for Gwendolyn. 130 left in the period. And they're gonna try to get it out. Mario intercepts it instead. Allen does keep possession. Trying to do some sort of play with it. Passes back. Friend's gonna intercept it. And now David's gonna try to get this one out of the zone. He does. He gets it back into the zone for his team. Fires, goal is intercepted easily. One in the hard shot, one in a difficult scoring chance. David has it right now. David has a cross. Oh, no! That one could have been great, but Kelly could not get his uh, stick on the ball. And looking right now to make some sort of play. And this one is going to come out of the zone with 55 seconds left. I'm just trying to get it in there, but he's not going to be helped out at all. Finally, his teammates got there. They can't keep it in. As Frank and G pass to uh, David to get this out of there. Frankie gets to David, cannot get it out of the way there. Mario's got to take it right now, 40 seconds left, trying to make some sort of play happen. And finally gets it out of there. No Watson called. Uh, Zeke has a lot of confidence in his, in, in his pick right now. Mario's Mario trying to steal some time in, this, in his team. 25 seconds left. Jess going to try to take over right now in the corner. Just looking, Jess fires to Mario. Oh, Ava couldn't keep it in. Fires a cross, easily saved by the goaltender. And yep, that will stop play offsides. They're gonna try to do a quick drop right here if they can, but with five seconds left, I don't think it's gonna happen. Four, three, two, and one, zero. Period over, but game is not, so stay tuned for the second half. Score at the end of one is Gwendolyn Black Knights two and the Islanders one.
Well, folks, I can be about to start in a quick second. Uh, I just take my Facebook real quick. It just embarrassed Matt a little bit. He, uh, he and his wife and Dennis Eskimo Jimenez were ice, was ice skating about an hour ago. You would think they would tire somebody out, but for, but for Matthew, no such deal. He's got two goals, and Zeke is calling a hat trick. Matthew's looking for it and put his team up three one as we head into the second period. Captains have said have said what they want to say. One team trying to come, make a comeback, the other team trying to kill it where it stands. Fans are going to start soon with the there's a lesser magazine about to drop the ball as soon as the clock is ready to start rolling. Oh wow, face off one. I thought they were going to call that one back on Gwenland because he because he went early, but they did not. And it looked like they called it one back because it hit the curtain. So we got our first stop to play about like less than 10 minutes, seconds in. But so is life. And then I gotta slow down a little bit because this game is fast. Don't let the low goal uh, count confuse you. Blink twice and you miss it. Blink once and you miss it. Blink at all and you miss everything. Matt's gonna have it in the, in the uh, zone right now. Pass it across. And Matt is gonna intercept it right there. Tries to get it out of there. Nick has it. Nick sires and it's gonna go wider than that. Trying to go, fires towards the center, towards the center, does not get there. Passes back, fires, and that uh, uh, pass, that shot, I should say. First, second shot was saved, and he, he whiffs again. Must be painful, he, he had two whiffs earlier on early in that on this opportunity. He doesn't whiff this time, but he does hit a flat, and this ball's still going to go wide the net. Ball in the corner right now, looking to make some sort of play with it. Looking to move around with it, looking to move, move, moving, moving. He's getting out, he's trying to get out of his zone, he does. And Andrew getting, trying to get back in the zone, does not do so. And this one's out. Oh no, we got two on one developing. Fire is saved by PJ. Man, it look easy, even though it definitely was not. But I don't the ball. They're gonna, they're gonna try and make that next time not easy at all. If they can get there. Gwendolyn gives him all, all kinds of heck as Nick tries to get out of the zone. And they finally do. No icing will be called, I don't think. Oh, they will call icing because there was no, I mean, no touch. And we're going to have Andrew uh, debating the call, but debates don't, uh, sometimes it can't, just can't want to debate. So that means that this, this faceoff is going to come all the way back in the zone. Face off one. Islanders try to get. Uh, it looked like it was one by Gwendolyn. Islanders try to keep him possessing now. Now it's the Matthew Matthew, Matthew Gansick trying to second bake through the zone. And it's Murray trying to take over. Intercepted. Great job by Gwendolyn right there. And fires towards the net. Save. Mario, can he get it out of there? He cannot do so. Uh, now it comes out. Looked like Gwendolyn was going to keep possessing, and they don't. Matthew has it right now. Matthew looking. Matthew going through the zone. Matthew gets the zone for his team and rolls back. It's always a small strategy. Unfortunately, Islanders not fall, falling fools to it. This ball is going to come back. Matthew has it right now. Matthew fires, save. Matthew trying to get the rebound, cannot get there. Better defense, and it's the Kelly. Kelly fires wide the net, and this one's in the corner right now. Can't see exactly to who has it from my from my angle, and this one's going to come out of the zone, and it will not be in. Now Gwendolyn's going to take over. They get it in their zone, in the zone for them. And just trying to get out and control of it. It was shot on. It goes uh, too soft. Goal is going to save that one all day. And make some sort of play with it. Murphy dumps it through. Can Andre get it out? Andre cannot. It's uh, tied about the feet right now. Fires. Great shot. Oh, send a low low to the post. The post has rejected it. No goal. Islanders came that close to tying this one up. 
And right now, I'm just having, having right now. And uh, this one's good, finally gonna come out. That one is Chris who has it. Chris looking. Chris trying to make a centering pass. It's a goal! Great centering pass to Kelly from Chris. And this one puts up Gwenlin 3 1. So we thought the Islanders were gonna catch uh, catch up easily. They aren't anymore. They've now have to, have to overcome a two goal lead as Gwenlin just, just, uh, just, just made the way. Well, so almost bounced away from DJ into the goal. But a great save for him nonetheless. Knock up in and look like Corey's gonna try to kill this icing off and he does. No icing, icing waved off. Right now, fell in the corners right now. Somebody's gotta get it out eventually. And it's to Dan. Dan looking to make some sort of play with it. Dan trying to get it out of there. It's now to Darren. And Darren gets it out. And it's taken over by Darren again. He fires and it's going to be deflected away by defense. Trying to get a centering pass. Cannot get there. Defense broke it up. Corner's got it right now. Great pass to Chris, but Chris wasn't paying attention. Almost offsides. Get back in. Chris has it now. Chris fires high and wide of the net. So Mario's going to take it over right now. And he's going to look for some sort of pass, some sort of opportunity. And this one has not come out. Andrew's going to have to take over right now. Andrew has it. Andrew looking. Andrew will pass. Does not, uh, it looked like this one will clear the zone. No icing. Gwendolyn cut it off. Right now at the boards. Dan trying to do something with it. Mandy keeps it in. Great job by her. And... Trying looking to make some sort of play with it. Turning pass does not go the way they want to. And Nick's gonna have this one. And it's gonna come out of the zone by the other Nick. Seek saying that that was a grill and prayer on Chris's part. I couldn't agree more. Uh, there's so many Gwendolyn goals from, uh, not just from this game, but from the last Gwendolyn Guardians game that definitely should be on Kevin Fawley's goal of the night. I'll be upset if there wasn't one on. And Gwenlin right there, Pass dumps it in, and he's going to get a chance. I don't just have it right now. Mario trying to take over right now. Mario going through his own zone, going through the middle, trying to make some sort of play with it. Takes over again. Now he's going to retreat around the kid before he passes back to Jeff. Just looking to make a play. Passes back to Mario. Great ball movement by them, but can they get a good breakout pass? Passes back to Jeff. Tag team and Aston going on. Andrew intercepts that pass. All, those, all that ball movement for nothing. And it's the Nick. Nick fires. Oh, he, he fell down in the play. They have a good shot either. Gwendolyn just had a good shot right there, though. And it's to Andrew. And finally, a penalty is called. And definitely was a high sticking on that call. And so, power play starts coming up soon. So, two minutes for wheeling around with the stick. We've got Suds, who's also doing the scoring for tonight's game with the injury downstairs watching also on the stream. So I put him for doing his job. Referees are doing a good job too, even though Gwendolyn doesn't think so with that penalty call. But a penalty is a penalty. Power play is about to start right now. And it's an end around, around 9.25, except that uh, Imagine just got chased out of the circle. So power play so for Bethlehem Fraction. Now I think it's going to end at 9.15 the power play. The Islanders beginning right now. Trying to find some sort of outlet pass. Cannot get the pass he wants to and can't get a stick on so he can't make the pass he wants to either. And this one will not clear the zone. Kept in. Look like I can't see what that is from this angle. And Melon trying to get it out. Matthew will finally get it out. And so penalty, come up, penalty killers come up big. And they take the, uh, take the time and prepare to defend some more. Not making some sort of move. Passing across. And Wilders get back into the zone. Try to make a pass across. Great pass across! But can't do anything, uh, any, anything you want to. And fires in. Oh, why the net? 
Matthew trying to do something with it. Matthew, can he clear the zone? It does. Give me enough time to respond to C's comment of trying to put a top 10 highlight together. At least it would be Gwendolyn. I couldn't agree more with that statement. But I don't know who wants to do the research for 10 goals. I, I would, but I just don't have the time to. Nice job and all. Gwendolyn's trying to clear the zone. Frankie trying to clear, clear it. And Matthew does get clear. Apparently his killer's doing a much better job. Power play time is rolling down. I don't know, trying to do something going on right now. Anna gets it in the zone. And it's to Matt Kelly. Matt Kelly will try to clear. David does. Allen is trying to take over right now again, trying to do, get something started. Damon tries to get it through. And it's through for the Islanders right now, looking to make some sort of play. David throws it in deep, and that one's going to clear the zone again. Great Murphy done by him. Gwendolyn well, getting some changes right now. Power play time is over for the Islanders. That could have changed this game away. But it was just not creative enough, and Gwilin slipped it out easily. Chris has it right now, going through. And right now, Tom looking to make some sort of play with it. Chris has it right now. Chris trying to get a centering pass, couldn't get there. And it's the Mario right now. Mario going through the zone. Uh, it's the David right now, and he's in the clear. Uh, six, and he likes some of the music of my boom buster. Raise against the machine plan. I'm glad you love it. Hopefully, the, hopefully it's uh, not explicit. I don't need any any kids uh, saying any curse words to their kids. Right now, I'm pretty sure the Islanders are saying what is for how this game is going because they're not doing as well as they really wish they would be doing. As Mario has it right now, Mario moving moving through. Mario uh, gets into the corner, tries to get it out of there, cannot do so. Um, it's cleared out right now. Oh, a two on one developing by the side goes. Has the goal and it's going to be easy. And uh, Kendrick Lazar right there. I want to say that's pointing right now. It's in the corner right now, trying to do something with it. Trying to get a pass across, possibly to Chris. Around the corner right now. Sadly there. And if this one does come out. I'm just going to have to get some time to reset. Try to get it out of there. Tom tries to make a centering pass or a centering shot. Either way, why the net? Tom's going to take over again. He has the second opportunity. Suit. And look like he hit the defense on the way there. It's going to knock. It's going to go wide the net. Dan has it. Dan fires. Oh, the other person went wide. And going this ball to take over right now as they try to clear the zone. Corner right now. He's looking to make some play with it. Passes. Great. Beautiful pass across. Fires. Wide the net. Could have been something big right there. And going to the outstretch of the lead. They do not this time. Taking over in the corner. Looking to make a play. Uh, can they clear the zone? Mandy tries to make a uh, pass through. Fires. Oh, the fucked away by defense. Oh, great save. Almost trickled through the five hole. And there was a hand pass on Gwendolyn, so that means that the uh, that means for sure that this ball is that this uh, ball is gonna be dropped out of the zone. Face off one, it looked like it was by Gwendolyn. And what's what's going on here? I missed the call, but it looked like Gwendolyn. I missed the call. It might have been too many men on. I'm not sure. Either way, Matt's hat trick is gonna have to wait. He's gonna have a he's gonna have a serve a two-minute minor. And if it is too many men on the ice, on the floor, that's what it's gonna be for. Power play for Allen's gonna have the second time to operate. They haven't had a, had much effect yet, but we'll see if that changes. Andrew looking. Andrew tries to get out of there. Can Andrew do so? Andrew does. Great clear up by him, but oh, Enzlin to keep the play going on. It didn't hit the backboard. Breakaway. Kelly fires. Could have had a story and a goal, but goal doesn't come up big and said. I thought the play was going to get stopped because I thought the, the steel beam hit here. It went all the way up where I am. I could have actually snapped out of the air and got it for some young fan if there was one here. Face off one by Gwellin, but I'll just take over and try to get something started on this on this uh, on this five man advantage. Fires. And that one's going to be deflected away for the, by the goaltender easily. Islanders passes around the cage. Trying to make something go happening right there. But defense was better. Great job by Andre. He says he's tired and can't play well. But I think he's playing phenomenal so far. 
There's balls in the corner right now. As Islanders are trying to make some sort of play with it. They make a great pass across, but can't get a good centering pass. Even who's in the way, can Andrew clear? He will not do so. Great keep in, and they did not hit the backboard too, so it's gonna have, so no, we still have to play. Darren's gonna have one out, Darren looking, Darren make, trying to make a centering pass, and it's gonna be held on by the goalie. Peter Darren, like we see, it's five minutes left in this game. Will Anders be able to make a comeback, or is two goals too much? We will see coming up after this faceoff. Based off one by Guadalupe, Andrew Clear uh, doesn't clear the zone. Matt has it right now the point. Fires. Oh no, Andrew almost deflected back into his own goal. I saw that earlier in another Guadalupe game when Abdul uh, then uh, Walmart, no, fam no favors. Fires. That one's going to go high and, and wide of the net. Andrew tries to take over again. Andrew tries to clear. Islanders have it. Islanders fire. Looked like it got saved out the goalie. Andrew lost his stick. Tried to stop it out of there. And power play time is up for the Islanders. Couldn't get uh, what they wanted to get started, but they still have the ball. Let's see if they can uh, change that around. Fires towards the goal. It looks so loose, so loose. Peter can't get control of it. And it finally is frozen. Ref lost sight of it, I think. So first legs for Gwendolyn right now with 3.50 left in this period. Bumpy ride to the finish, fans. And at 3.46, Islanders take a timeout. So folks, just a, re just a quick recap, now you can see my face a little bit, I don't know if, uh, how many guys I'm scaring off, but just a quick recap, the other Gwendolyn team, the Gwendolyn Guardians, won their game earlier 8-4, to four. seven different scorers. I have never seen that in, in my life, but for a great new year and a great new season for both for the Gwendolyn Hope uh, program, it's a great start to the, great start. We'll see if they can keep it up right now. If they can win this face off, they can definitely win this game. It's starting off right now. With the face off coming up in their own zone. Face off won by Gwendolyn. Dan's gonna try to make it on net. Cannot do so. Passes across. Chris is gonna have to take over right now. Chris clears the zone. Just gets it back into the zone, but all the teams offside. So can't make a play. Now they can. Dan trying to make a play on it. Dan does. Dan passes across, but this one to the point, but this one's gonna come back. Just went in the right position. Passes right back again. Mandy has it right now. Man trying to make a play on it. And it now is taking over right now. Chris trying to get it out of there. Chris does. We will have a stoppage of play. And it's because Chris, Chris did not get a penalty, but does get a foul. You cannot grab the ball. You can only bat it down. Unfortunately, he did grab the ball. It would have been great, <laughs> it would have been great if he was a uh, wide receiver in the NFL. Unfortunately, he's not. Face off one. Manny has it right now for the for the Black Knights. And trying to clear the zone. This time they will. We have a three on two developing right now. And both checked away. Mario tries to clear this to Tom. Tom has it. Tom looking. Both checked away. Great job by them. And it's the point right now. He's trying to make some sort of play with it. And play stops. Looked like it might look like it rolled out of play. Face was gonna happen right now. Face off one by Gwendolyn. Mario's trying to take it over right now in his own uh, defensive end. Pass to Anna. Kelly has it right now. Kelly looking. Kelly trying to make a pass across and not do so. And as the Islanders should take it out. Two minutes left in the game. Two minute warning. Oh! Why is it? There's not gonna be a tripping call. Finally, there is one. Oh, and the Gwendolyn player is getting too mu uh, doing too much right now. Getting in the player's face. Don't want to paralyze yourself right here. And two minutes for tripping. 
For the rest of this game, unless a goal is scored, Islanders will finish the man short, and that's not the position you want to be, with, be in, losing by two goals. Face off one by Matt Fires, and it goes high. Oh, almost a centering pass to Matt. And that's really not trying to think about getting the hat trick right now. He's just not trying to think about winning this one. I don't know trying to battle right now in the corner, trying to get it loose, possibly. Will not come out. Finally comes out. One minute, one minute left in the game. And we'll see if any team can get an advance. Comes out of the zone. Now trying to do something to make a team come back. This one's going to fly back in. I don't know trying to do something with it. Matt looking. Matt moves through. I assume a goalie pull is going to come out soon. No goalie pull. I'm interested by this call by the Islanders. Probably don't want to have a foul on fire advantage. Mandy's going to try to clear this one and. And Matthew has it. Matthew, break away. And no hat trick. Goalie stonewalls him. 30 seconds left. Frankie has it. Frank, shot. And that was like why Anna will try to clear it. Kept in by Nick. 20 seconds left to go. Fires. Stop by the defense right there. And they clear the net. They clear, they clear the zone to Andrew. 10 seconds left. And Seek, I can't. Seek, I will be honest. Don't, please don't bet because your hat trick goal didn't come, uh, your hat trick didn't come through. But the Black Knights will win this game as Matthew put in two of their goals in this one. Great performance by him. PJ like almost nothing in. Both these guys. We need to have an incentive program so one of these guys get like a uh, some dinner on uh, Gordon Bruce or something out of the game. Either way, great job by uh, great job by Guadalin. Making this game come through. Not all streamers do it, but I will show you the handshake line because sportsmanship is what this league is all about, as well as the competition. Thank you for tuning in with this game. My uh, for this game, my name is Claude Fruitbuckers Williams of the Midnight Riders. Your final score in this one: Gwendolyn Black Knights three, Islanders one. Have a great night, guys. Happy New Year, and get home or stay home safely.